Good morning. Welcome to the WCCE Morning News Show. My name is Katie and I'll be your anchor for today, Friday, March 22nd, 2019. This is day four for activity classes. Here's Matthew with the weather. The current temperature in Clover, South Carolina is 38 degrees. Today's high is 64 degrees and tonight's low is 36 degrees. The forecast today is sunny. Now back to our anchor. Thank you. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I salute the flag of South Carolina and pledge to the Palmetto State, love, loyalty, and faith. At Crowder's Creek, we pledge to seek smart solutions, be on board with learning, act responsibly, and respect others. And now for a moment of silence. Today for lunch, we will have cheese pizza, hot ham and cheese, and crispy chicken salad. Dr. Dickey, Ms. Hamilton, and Mr. Craig would like to wish a happy birthday to Jalen Harden, KJ Meeks, and Hunter Osborne. On Saturday to Wyatt James, Oliver Vines, and Aiden White. On Sunday to Isabella Fluin, Lucas Gaktench, Gage Hildebrand, Addison Kirk, and Ryan Stern. Your teacher will provide you with your birthday pencil. Good morning, boys and girls. Couple reminders for our Battle of Books participants. This is the last weekend before the competition. So a last chance to finish up a uh, a couple books if you haven't finished them. Also, there are a couple teams that have still not turned in their team poster. Please do so by Monday. And if there's any chance that you can get together with your teammates this weekend to discuss the books, that would be a great idea. And don't forget, you have to memorize the titles and the authors of all 10 books. Have a great weekend. Happy Friday, boys and girls. I hope your day is off to a great start. I know mine is me, Miss Hamilton, and Mr. Craig, along with many PTO members and families, and especially some students, got to go to the Charlotte Hornets basketball game and cheer them on to a victory. Several of our students got to witness the shoot around, and they also got to go down on the floor when the national anthem was sung. So I want to thank you all for coming out last night. We had a wonderful time, and I think we brought the Hornets good luck because we got a win. I also want to remind you that making good choices will always pay off for you each and every day and i want to invite a special guest as promised that we um invited yesterday but she was not at school she had a birthday on yesterday too and that is vivian lewis come on over vivian vivian is a second grade student in miss morgan's class and let me read to you just a little bit about what she had to say Vivian always tries her best to make good choices at school. She has a sweet spirit and displays acts of kindness each day. Vivian takes the time to offer help to her classmate friends and teachers. There are multiple times that I have witnessed Vivian soaring. I have seen her pick up trash and organize the playground materials during recess. She soars in the classroom by offering words of encouragement to her classmates and teacher. Recently, Vivian offered to help organize classroom materials during her indoor recess time. She is a true example of what it means to soar at Crowders Creek. Wow, Vivian, I am so incredibly proud of you. You had so many examples of what it means to soar. And boys and girls, just hearing about what Vivian is doing certainly should give you some ideas on ways that you can soar as well. So I'm gonna present you with this certificate and this pencil that says my principal is very proud of me. And also, happy birthday. Is there anything that you would like to say to our other Crowders Creek friends? Keep sewing. She said, keep sewing, boys and girls, and you could be right here on this sofa with me. I hope to have you soon. Have a great day. Good morning, boys and girls. I am so excited because I have some more special guests with me. This morning, I have with me the River Hills Rockets. And this is our fantastic robotics team that will be traveling to Asheville this weekend for a big competition. Boys and girls, I am so proud of them. They have worked so hard. And we also want to thank our coach, Ms. Perrin, and all of the families and parents that have made this possible. So I'm going to present each one of you with a special pen. And 
this is just a way to celebrate your hard work with working on STEM activities and just becoming smarter each day by building and using those science and engineering practice practices. So now I'm going to step out of the way and we'll have our team to introduce themselves. But boys and girls, if you see them in the hall, please give them a thumb up and wish them good luck on their competition this weekend. My name is Quinton. I am in first grade and my teacher's name is Miss Bolton. I'm Joyce. I'm in second grade and my teacher's name is Miss Champa. I, I'm in for first grade. My name is Erin and, and I'm in Miss Mabry's class. My name is Luke. I'm in third grade and my teacher is Miss Williams. My name is Tyler. I'm in third grade and my teacher is Miss Moore. My name is Sandy, I'm in first grade and my teacher is Miss Molly. My name is Keegan and I'm in second grade and my teacher is Miss Early. That's all the news for today. Thank you for watching WCCE Morning News Show. Have a great day.